Okay, so there are two reasons why someone would get a television headset. One, either you're hard of hearing, or two, you don't wanna disturb your neighbors or your loved ones. Now, we have a two-month-old in our house, and I don't wanna disturb him with the impeccable 7.1, 7.1.2 Dolby surround system that we have from the HTS 5000. So I got a headset so that all the sound stays in my mind. So anything with this consistent episode, we're gonna take a look at the Sony WH-L600 and that's coming up. Hey, what's up guys? This is Hooray from Hooray's World, showing you that IT means I try. If you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to subscribe. So on this channel, we do unboxings, desktop support, life hacks, actual hacking, tech reviews of great products. So today we're going to unbox and review the Sony WH-L600. It is apartment and nighttime friendly, so you don't wake up your loved ones or incur the wrath of neighbors. Anything we we'll discuss in this episode, you will find right on the bottom right over here. So this is a 7.1.2 Dolby surround system that's gonna keep all your movie you're watching just as if you have your booming Dolby surround system here. So let's go take a look. Anything we we'll discuss in this episode, you'll find right on the bottom right over here. Let's go unbox. Let the, the unboxing begin. Now, unlike other um, headphones, this is specifically for the Sony system. I got this for $179. And this is going to be an all-in-one audio headset, which means it's gonna have Dolby Surround. It's gonna have 3.5 jacks inside. This is not for headphones. It's specifically for Sony TVs. Let's take a look and see what comes in the box. Okay, we have digital optical cable. We have a power brick. We take a look at the system. Now it's well packed. And let's take a look at the charging base first. So this is a wireless headset. It's gonna be easy connectivity. Let's take this off which means you're going to have a radio frequency that's gonna let you move up to 98 feet. 98.43 feet. You can go through walls, through ceilings. This will have 17 hours of charge and it's gonna help simulate the Dolby surround system that you're accustomed to. Or if you don't have Dolby surround system in your house, this is going to do quite nicely. So let's take a look at the headset. We have a nice soft cushion here. It's very, very nice here. And if you take a look at the base here, you're going to be able to charge just by placing it on the dock. And once you do, this has connectivity points of HDMI, digital optical, cable, wireless, it has Dolby Audio, and DTS for surround. Now you can change your field of view and the input that you have. Let's take a look at the bottom. We have gain high and low, we have audio in, we have optical cable, and HDMI arc here, and the power cable. So this is going to be good for different type of options. You'll have HD sound, it comes with four different modes. It's optimized for cinema, it's durable, it has 40 millimeter drivers for clear, warm, detailed sounds. You're gonna have dynamic range and it's gonna simulate 7.1 Dolby surround. Now, it's made for extreme comfort, so let's take a look and see how they fit on my ears and We'll okay, so first you're gonna get an over-the-ear closed back design, which is gonna help keep out external noise. So it's gonna isolate it here. Even now, when it's connected to nothing, I can hear my voice, but it's, it sounds 
like I'm in an enclosed. Now you have large 40 millimeter drivers for an immersive sound and the padding, it's really, really generous. And when I push on the side, the headband and cup are really good. Now it's a rechargeable battery. It provides seven hours of operation and you have on-ear volume and listening modes. All you need to do is pop those in and when you're not using it, it turns off automatically. Now the weight of these headphones, they're about 10 ounces. Now, if you're not familiar with Sony sound, you're gonna get a really rich sound stage. And with these 40 millimeter, 40 millimeter driver, it's gonna have immersive booming bass. So this is gonna be really good. And this is gonna simulate a 7.1 Dolby surround system. So I have here the HTS. 5000 it's really really immersive but you don't want to disturb the, my son or the neighbors so this is going to do quite nicely Good to put it not through hdmi but digital optical and i have it going through the output so in here out of the tv because i already have the sony hts 5000 here with a couple hdmi's already plugged in to the arc HDMI port. Now, once that's there, let's put this back and we'll neaten this up. But it's a very simple setup. Okay, so next we have here, and all we need to do is to grab the headphones, and all you need to do, you'll see that the input power is here so all you need to do is to leave it on optical because this is the input so we have cinema so the sound field if you're listening to the cinema you'll see cinema then this is game this is sports and that's so next we can lower the volume of the TV all the way down and let me turn you guys around like so and now all we do is we put the headphone on and all you want to do is to hold the power button right here for two seconds and once it's on you throw it in and it is on optical so it's always on optical it's a very comfortable fit it's ergonomically pleasing let's take a look and see how the sound is so let me play a video and immediately now it's pitching very, very nice. So you have a really good sound stage. The volume on cinema is really good. Okay, let me see if I can put this on your neck so you can hear it. 10, five, zero. Now everybody watching this that owns a Tesla, I need you to prove me right if you do not have the Sounds sound really full, notice. really rich. And let me put the volume up a little bit. The highs are good and it's mimicking 7.1.2 Dolby Surround. Check it out. I will leave the release notes up um, while I just say a couple Volume things up. about the release. So this update only has two but it's That's still a really exciting update. So first up we have automatic wiper improvements. Elon Musk. Yeah, my good. game of choice is Destiny. So if you're playing with these, um, you're gonna get a really good sound but you're not able to chat. But it sounds really good. 7.1. Dolby Surround sounds really good. So I'm playing PlayStation 4. Now I have, uh, I've been playing this a little bit. I have a little bit of sweat on my ears here because it's a little hot. It's gonna be cold, but these are really good. The sound coming out here is epic. Um, are you in the, in? who's this for? The market for this is if you are not able to hear well your sound, and you don't want to disturb your people, this is really good. Uh, for movies, for sports, it's really, really clear. Really high highs, the bass, the 40 millimeter uh, subwoofer on here, really, really good. I really like these. I wonder if there's another uh, brand that even comes close. I don't think so. So if you have a Sony TV and you're looking to get immersive sound without bringing the house down or waking your neighbors the sony wh l600s are really really good i will catch you guys in the next one remember it means i try
pace. Now, in point of fact, if you are playing Destiny 2 and you see Silent Wolf run, run, catch you guys in the next one. Pace. Good job, Sonny. <laughs>